To sit and listen to a lion roar in the African bush is to sit on the edge of paradise. A wilderness that is both rare and essential. Without lions and other beacons, the world will increasingly become a place filled with clutter and noise. And the noble statues of lions that grace our cities will stand silently as the reminders of the folk in the road we could have taken. The lion is a symbol of bravery, courage, power, strength. When you think of a lion, does the word vulnerable come to mind? Because that's exactly how the IUCN categorizes them on the red list of threatened species. It is estimated that land populations have declined from around 200,000 as recently as 1975 to only 32,000 or so today. Some estimates suggest they are significantly fewer than that. In 2009, Kenyan authorities predicted extinction within the country by 2018, whilst vets in South Africa's Kruger National Park expect to lose 80% of its lions over the same time period due to disease. With few exceptions, Lion populations now occur only in isolated areas, with their long-term viability in doubt. The African Lion Rehabilitation and Release into the Wild program is an active conservation effort operating at Andalo Park in central Zimbabwe and by Lion Encounter on both sides of the majestic Victoria Falls. The program is Africa's first genuine effort to reintroduce the offspring of captive bred African lions into the wild. First, cubs born in our breeding center are bonded to human handlers. From six weeks old, the cubs are taken out into the wild on walks. They are accompanied by experienced handlers who act as dominant members of the pride and give the young lions the sense of security they need to engage in natural behaviors. On these walks, the cubs have the opportunity to play, to explore, socialize, and begin to develop their hunting instincts. By three years old, the lions are ready to enter the release stages of the program. They are released as a prior that becomes self-sustaining and develop a natural social system in a secure semi-wild environment. This means that the area is fenced for the protection of the lions and for communities living nearby. These lions give birth to cubs which are raised by the pride in the managed ecosystem free of any human contact. These cubs will develop as any wild-born cub, learning the skills that will enable their reintroduction into appropriate national parks and reserves across the African continent as the final stage of the African Lion Rehabilitation and Release into the Wild program. Our conservation efforts are supported by ALERT, a non-profit organization dedicated to finding innovative ways to secure a future for the African lion. Recognizing the species' potential to provide substantial social, cultural, ecological and economic benefits. Alert believes that the challenges facing Africa can best be met by uniting communities with policy makers, conservation managers, researchers and business leaders in order to make the best decisions for Africa's people, its environment and its wildlife. As such, Alert also comprises the Alert Communities Trust that promotes community action in support of conservation by empowering people to protect and restore their environment 
whilst improving livelihoods through benefit sharing. Also, the Conservation Centre for Wild Africa focuses on the conservation of habitat and the diversity of Africa's wildlife, recognising the symbiotic relationship between the lion and the delicate ecosystems on which it relies. Antelope Park and Lion Encounter, in partnership with Alert, offer unique opportunities to get involved in our conservation and community programs. We welcome day visitors as well as self-funded volunteers, interns and research students. These commercial aspects of our program raise significant funding for our work. But this needs to be supplemented by donations made through the charity if we are to achieve long-term success. By visiting us today, you have directly contributed, but you can further assist us after your walk. You can purchase merchandise from our range, sponsoring the lions, becoming a member of our pride, or simply make a donation to the charity. Please speak to your guide or have a look at our websites about these options before you leave us today. The time to act to save Africa's wild heritage is now. We all must come together and with one voice vow to protect the African lion, a precious gift to mankind. The lion is a key symbol of Africa and many of our indigenous cultures. Its extinction would represent a huge loss to Africa's identity. The wildlife and its habitat cannot speak, so we must and we will.